to the Australian clergyman who is run off his feet carrying out exorcisms. For many of us, we know about exorcisms only from classic movie clips with its depiction of priests trying to help a girl who's possessed. Let's remind ourselves. Let your mighty hand cast him out of your servant, Reagan Therese McNeil. In the Christian faith, Jesus cured people possessed by demons and for the first two centuries of Christianity it was considered a special gift 2,000 years later. Exorcism remains a part of Roman Catholic canon law. In fact it's in such high demand that Queensland Uniting Church Reverend John Gill has more work than he can handle. He's on the Gold Coast this morning. John good morning to you. We know how busy you've become because we've been trying to get you on the show for <laughs> weeks now and you've been flat out. Who's using your services? Um, everyone, Basil. Um, so, good morning. It's um, become an epidemic in our country, I think, because of the, the rampant um, secularism in our country, uh, as well as other Western countries. We think we are immune to evil by ignoring it. And I think that's what's led us down the garden path, seeking after other things. So are there any areas of Australia that you're called out to more frequently than others? I, I would probably say generally North Queensland, a lot of it down towards the south. I won't know name any particular places for the sake of people's um, uh, anonymity. Okay. Um, however, there are definitely hot spots on the Gold Coast towards New South Wales, before Sydney, um, up north in regional areas in particular where people are subject to uh, others that are involved in various other spiritualities that uh, sort of invite that sort of thing in. All right, Reverend. Now, I want to be clear here. You are a believer in heaven and hell and you say that demonic possession in Australia is not only real, but it's reached alarming levels. Now, why would that be the case? OK, I'll firstly clarify, I believe uh, in heaven, uh, hell is probably an arguable thing um, that it is, yes, we talk about hell as the end of existence for those who don't want it rather than hellfire and burning forever. Um, heaven is just uh, the place where God is until he comes back to be with us. Um, but... Um, your question about being why is it so rampant, is that correct? That yes, yes, yeah. yeah. We have been, uh, since 